Welcome to Digital Toolbox. In this video we're going to go over the two different types of cameras that 3DS has to offer. Um, we're going to find them under the toolbar under Create and Cameras, and then we'll <clears throat> create the two different types of cameras, Target or Free. Uh, free camera is basically just uh, the viewport camera, um, tries to emulate a camera in real life, and you can uh, edit it, move it, transform it anywhere you want. So we'll create that one first. Free, click on free, and then in the front viewport, um, we'll just click it anywhere we want. So then we can see it in all the viewports. I'm going to go and move it. <clears throat> and then in the perspective viewport, I can, I can move it in uh, the perspective viewport, but I'm just going to uh, right click on perspective, go up to cameras, and then camera one. And then now in this viewport, we're seeing what the, the camera view is. So I can move it out a little bit, and um, you know, we've got most of the Farnsworth house in there. Um, the camera is just like an object. I'm going to change the color so you, you might be able to see it. And that's it. We can move it anywhere, uh, transform it just like we would many other objects. And that's about it. Um, Trying to zone, uh, zoom in on one object is a little bit more difficult with this, but this camera is good for um, fly-throughs where you don't care where it's uh, so much as to where it's looking, um, or just panning around uh, shots like that. So that's the free camera. Delete that, and then go to target camera. Here I will click in my front viewport and then drag out the target. So this uh, camera is defined by both the camera icon and the target which has this line that goes out to it to a little cube. The cube is the, the target. So you can manipulate both the camera and the cube which is the, the target that it's always going to be looking at. So if I know that I want to look at something specific on my building I can take the, the target and drag it to, say, the corner of this top stair, verify its elevation in another view. Now, that looks pretty good for the target. I'll go into my perspective view and click on camera one. So I want to drag this guy out a little bit. And there we have it. So you can see by uh, the viewport on the bottom right that that's what you're getting. And if you move the camera around, it's going to focus on that that one uh, center all the time. So this is good for panning around a specific or orbiting around a you know your building or a specific object in the scene without having to you know, rotate the entire camera around. You just move the vantage point and then you have that focused lens on uh, one specific point. So that's the two different types of cameras and then we'll have another one on modifying the different types of cameras which you can try out by going under the modify panel and switch to different projection styles, different lens styles to make you know, a different point of view and uh, even setting the uh, range and clipping planes for that. So those are the two different types of cameras in 3DS.